Okay, so we need to break into prison. Bonsai's aren't on, so we should be good. I'm a little worried. Is that where visitation was? Just the yard. This is it. Colorful shooting star. Um, how do you craft that? Can you mine these? Oh, dude, if I break this, I'm gonna feel like such an asshole. I'm assuming that just doesn't break. Oh, it's, it's leaving. Oh, I'll get back here. If you hit them, they explode. Oh. If you hit them, they explode with items a few times before despawning. Oof. Okay, um... I'm stealing this. <laughs> hey, fuck face! Hey, fuck face! Slack, can I ask you a question? Of course, my king. I'm you gonna wanna ask a... me or the magic conch? Oh, yeah, I can I ask the conch? Yeah! Okay. Oh, magic conch, is my soccer ball server side? Sounds like a lot of hoopla. Fuck. Um, can you kick that? I can see it. Let me see if I can kick it. Yeah, I can kick it. Okay, so like you're seeing everything I'm seeing. It looks like you are. I just bounce out the wall, yeah. So theoretically, we could make a soccer ball course, which is called, you know, a field. And we could make yeah. little soccer ball teams and maybe even see if cars interact with these and put the boost pads down and make Rocket League. Ooh, you want to test the cars? Well, I'm afraid because Saren told me these things blow up. Oh. But she said with certain items, so we're probably fine. But that's pretty neat. I think this would be fun. We can make little three by three soccer teams and make a little stadium for this. Like it could be fantastic. Yeah, we could do. We could do. You know, sh show off our fall guys um, prowess and just shit oh. on them all. Oh, oh, oh! How, oh, you punched. Hey, it. maybe be careful because it's changing color, and if it does blow up, we might want to not do it inside of your building. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I... Only That's if you it. actively punch it, it will pop out of Spectrum stuff and die. Yeah, maybe don't punch it anymore like I was doing there. <laughs> that could have been bad. You're yeah, now it's here. yellow. Uh, is yellow good or bad? I don't know what's now it's, good or okay, not. Okay, it's just changing um, colors. I'm gonna, let's, uh, let's go take some cars and hit it in a safer area, maybe. Did you pick it up? No, oh. it's right here. Oh, that might have been a little... Yeah. Okay, um, yeah. you want to go to Crewcraft and hit it with a car? Yeah, I want to bring yeah, my mate. car over. Okay. I'm going to put the soccer ball down if you just want to hit it as hard as you can with your car and we'll see if it goes flying. Okay. I'm going to get a drift into it. Okay. I really do wonder if this is going to... Okay, so it looks like Rocket League's canceled, but we can play regular people soccer with our feet. Oh. Yeah, it looks like soccer is canceled. Are oh, you... it's moving. So what happened with the drift? You just missed or because it looked like you hit it. No, I went right over it. Like sometimes I hit it, sometimes I just drive right over it. Oh, that's weird. Okay. Oh, gosh. Ooh. Oh, it's freaking oh, out. Oh, it's freaking, freaking out. out. Oh, Ooh, where'd oh, it go? Where'd oh, it go? It's over oh. Here. It, oh, it's over here. Okay, it looks like these aren't, like, completely not laggy. I feel like... It, I, I oh, We should probably do some more testing before I build oh, a soccer pitch. Oh, we should probably use our feetsies. Oh, oh God. Oh, gosh. I, I, oh, I got God. it. I got it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, we, oh, I can't even pick it up right now. How do you pick it up? A shift right click and it's just not picking up. Oh, you want to just punch it? It's not moving, is it? Nope, it's definitely. Dude, this isn't even my soccer ball, dude. Oh, it's changing colors. It's gonna fucking blow. <laughs> it's changing colors pretty fast, bro. Is it technically on a different block or like what's our problem here? Nope, that didn't do anything. Oh, I mined it. That's weird. I don't know why that worked. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay, um, well, maybe we, maybe we just build maybe a soccer make... pitch and, like, you know, if cars do work with it, so be it. Yeah. Yeah. We can still jest it, yeah. Yeah, probably uh, fine. Uh, Thanks for your helping with testing Slack Attack. Is, is there stuff you wanted to show me for show and tell? Yeah, you want to see the farm stuff I've done? Yeah, I like farm stuff. See you at the power plant. Okay. I gotta drive this big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, uh, I got, um, this farm. It's great, um, but what's it? The, it's gonna set this apart is the fact that it's gonna be a factory experience like tour Ooh. thing. 
So but the idea is you're going to walk up to it, you're going to press a button, and you'll be greeted with, like, a switch yes. for the end product. Okay. And it's going to take you on this wonderful, lush tour, and it's gonna you're going to see everything in action, and then you'll get this one thing at the end. And am I allowed so, to know what the one thing is? And that one is? thing is, so far, it's going to be chocolate milk, but um, I might make it something else. Oh, that's fancy. Fancy. Okay, now come on, come on around to the side. The first part of it is gonna you're gonna see what happens to the cows. So the cows, you've seen this, right? Uh, no. This is I've not seen any of this. Okay, so when the cows uh, are ready, like when you pass by the the tour in this part, it's gonna be timed where the cows get pulled up, and then things are gonna happen. The cows will be milked. Oh. Oh, is this like an adult tour or is this like, can anyone see this? Anyone can see this. Yeah, they just, they're just they just going to get milked and then there's going to be something inside that bounces the buckets around and that thing can like go up and down. So you're going to see things move as the tour goes on. That's exciting. When, when's this going to be ready? I have no idea. It's really hard and um, it takes a while and I get distracted every time I get on. Oh, like someone asked me I to hit a soccer ball with a tractor? <laughs> yeah, he was so handsome, I couldn't deny. <laughs> I don't blame you there, yeah. Such a deep, rugged yeah. voice that guy has. Yeah. I might make this... So the, the tour is going to, like, take you above, so you're going to probably, like, see everything from, like, a little bit of a height. Okay. You're going to be on, like, a conveyor belt, so you just don't move and everything happens. Maybe this whole bee face is just going to open up, and then you're going to go inside, and then you'll see the honey part, because I'm going to make honey apples as well. Ooh, fun. So it's going to be like a full-on farm tour. An interactive experience, yeah. unlike anything you've ever seen before. Yeah, so this will have uh, we'll have piping in here, and the honey will be extracted, and you'll see, like, the, you'll go through here, and the bees will be, like, around. And then maybe you'll, like, hang a, hang a, uh, a Roger and go inside, and then see everything else happen. Kind of like... Yeah. Do you have other animals besides bees and milks? Um, as of right now, no. I don't think any other animal is importante for the Yeah, I feel you. Yeah. End product. Oh, I'm so excited for this. This will be fun. Yeah. How many people per it... group on the tour? Is it a one person tour or can we like have more? Well, bars? Uh, we could probably do like two or three. Okay. Uh, because you'll you'll sit on a conveyor belt and as long as you guys kinda position yourselves and just don't move, you'll be fine. Sweet. Oh, I'm excited. Yeah. I'm going to have to take my tour of sidearms and D20. They're my friends. They're yeah. <laughs> my friends. Um, but yeah, hopefully I can get it done. Um, definitely this weekend, I'll probably try to knock a lot of it out. It's just like, yeah, you figure out one process and it's not it's not meant to be simple. That's just leave it at that. So hey, the best things like aren't, you know? Me. Yeah. Yeah, it's that, it's that extra work you put in that's going to make you think, I made this. I made. That's why I only make my own food now. With each bite, I taste it and I think, wow, I, I made this. I, I, ordered I need to start cooking for my... <laughs> 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 I made this. <laughs> oh, boy. All right, chat, where do we put a soccer ball field? Right here is perfect, but I don't have the heart to tell G to move his fucking house again. Right here is also perfect, but, I mean, goddamn, so I'd put a floating turret on top of it. Let's see what D20's been up to with this. So he's got a border on... Oh, there's my cat. Oh, D20 putting the work in down here. So it looks like he's got the starting area down here for the race course. Uh, let me just hop in my car and drive it, I guess. There's no reason not to, right? Aww. I still don't understand that in the top left. Do you guys see that? It, it says we're, like, hitting, like, five, six miles per second. But we're clearly not even moving that far. Do you guys notice that? So, like, something's wrong with the metrics of the game that they think we're moving miles at a time. Like, miles a second. Um, but, yeah, that's definitely faulty, right, chat? Yeah, something's really messed up with that. Because we're, like, hardly moving. And it says we're moving just miles at a time, chat. It doesn't make any sense. Um, but I'm sure it's fine. All right, let's start driving. We got the border around the whole thing. I would imagine this deep slate was all placed by him, right? Yeah, that looks great. Then we got the tunnel of love down here. There's also boost pads. Oh, he's got the arrows in here. That looks great. And then he placed all of this down here as well. All these, like, uh, these walls. Which is really cool because it's kind of like the undercarriage of the city. Like, you can see my streets and everything down here. Um, 
And this is right below the actual brick building too, which is neat. So it's like the bricks went underground. Then we got this tunnel where it goes two different directions. And this must be what he needed the copper for. So we have like a poop pipe down here and then it looks like um, he did like his own shit blend on the ground. We'll have to get the actual tour from D20, but I'm pretty sure this is a shit pipe. Um, then you go through the actual shitums. Then you come up these little ramps to where the shit pipes come out here. It looks like you're actually able to fall off the course right here if you're not careful. And then you come up to this level. Then you hit the boost pad. Okay, dude, this is great. Let me see how tough it is to navigate some of these areas over here. I don't think there's any way to make the cars go faster. Besides the boost pads. Ooh, that's a hairpin turn right there, okay. We'll have to be ready for that whenever we actually race. And we can also like worry about getting the best made car and stuff. We could also turn the city into a circuit too, if, if we're interested. There's no reason why the city can't actually be like a little bit of course, although the streets aren't too interesting, they're just straight lines. Okay, this is great. Is this the Kissing Cousins Classic Part 2? I mean, it could be, honestly, if, if D20 is interested in giving it that moniker. Uh, but I did definitely build the Kissing Cousin, the Kissing Cousins Classic on our, our modded crewcraft season, where Sidearms built that, built that big toilet. Um, so pretty cool stuff. Uh, Jack Ace, thanks for getting a sub to Pussy. Welcome back, Pussy. So what's the red building? There's no way anyone's still using this, right? Puffy's Temp Shop. We'll fully stock tomorrow. Hmm. I don't know if they're still using that. What the fuck's this shit? Free stuff. Yo, I love free shit. Where's the free shit? If this is a bad spot, let me know I'll move. Yeah, I'm putting a soccer field here, dude. Is this the card shop? Yeah, it's the card shop. Okay, maybe we just go somewhere else. I don't know if it's the best spot. I don't think we can get the land rights here. Although a soccer pitch would fucking slap here. Now here's the thing, even though it's outdoor soccer ball, we would still need to put a wall on things because um, we don't want our soccer ball getting out because our soccer ball is a little goofy. So it'd be like indoor soccer, but it's outside. So you can do some sick wall bounces. Thought I blew up my soccer ball. <laughs> Okay, I think we still have our soccer ball. Oh, God. It's crapping die. Oh, God, it's crapping die. How do I get my soccer ball back? Okay, that's... That's good. All right, we still have our soccer ball. I'm starting to wonder, is this soccer ball safe? It does crap die. Can you break this thing? This this is a this is a borrowed soccer ball. This is like when you pull up at the basketball hoop in, the, in like, the middle of the city and you bring an Amazon Basics basketball, you know? Uh, KYR, will my dick fit? Thank you for the nine months. Will my dick fit? Chad, I, I completely forgot to show you guys something. We had show and tell today, and I, I completely fucked it. So everyone sit back, and let's do some show and tell. When it comes to keeping your money safe, there's no place better than the Gold Trust Bank. Our beautiful spawn side location features a plethora of services to benefit our clientele. From offering free coin to item conversion, nice. the purchase of server-exclusive items, and our world-famous Randy Fast Hands Handies that our employee Randall provides in the back room. Nice. Due to sanitary-related oh. issues brought up by Homies HR, Randy Fast Hands Handies are no longer available at this location. We apologize for the inconvenience. Are the other okay? Our biggest attraction the other locations is our still vault. have them? Our state-of-the-art vault is one of the most secure in the world, requiring both a light code and a vault key to gain access, ensuring your money's protection from any rule-breaking homie that may come along and try to break in. So whether you're looking to protect your money, purchase items, or just find a comfy bench to relax, come visit the Gold Trust Bank and see why we're the right choice for you. I love Minecraft. Shout out JoJo Solos and Minecraft. Is that something we need to decipher? It's so fun. Was that last image something we need to decipher? Probably, right? That looked like something we need to decipher. Let's get some of our top minds on top of that. Um, I think Cullen made that video, and it was just fantastic. So where is the vault at in here? Ooh, I don't know if I'm supposed to be back here. 
Okay, I did find it. I probably shouldn't be here, though. I don't know if I'm allowed to jump over the table. That was probably... Oh, God. Yeah, people are always watching. Okay. Let's maybe bring a squad together. We'll try to break into the, the vault some night. All right, what's that look like? I think that's a perfect size for a soccer chat. I, I really do think it is. Is it, you know, encroaching on spawn? Maybe a little much. Probably, but, like, does anyone care? And we'll have to figure out the soccer ball goal over there, but it should be fine. I would be shocked if the soccer ball interacts with the boost pad, but, I mean, we might as well try. Fuck. It wasn't my soccer ball. That wasn't my soccer ball, dude. No. Okay, I'm gonna leave that there for further testing. We're gonna continue making a soccer ball, but I don't know if we're gonna have enough soccers for the soccer ball. Uh, the perfect Snickers vein. Thanks to the biddies. Been one of those gosh darn awful vod goblins lately. Oof. So I'm sorry. Yo. So you're a towel. Yo, thank you, uh, the perfect Snickers vein. I appreciate that. Hot dude abs. Thank you for the 33 months. Hot dude abs. Uh, KYR prolapsed urethra. Thank you for the sub. Welcome back. Prolapsed urethra. And KYR stinky cummy butthole. Thank you for the 15 months. What a great community. Welcome back, stinky cummy butthole. Two shooting stars. Chat, we have more soccer ball. Whoa. They're different ones? We have different soccer balls? Wow. Okay, let's keep one in there in case I blow this one up. And then we need to remember we do need to give the bonsais their soccer ball back. Ooh, what's happening what's up, here? Alex? I'm making a soccer ball field. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. What you up Would to? Would be a shame if I called it football? Oh, no, I'd appreciate it if you just used the correct terminology. Football? Yeah, soccer ball. We're talking about like the real shit, like MLS, Major League Soccer. That's the good stuff. Dallas FC, Real Salt Lake. How the shit. does everyone? On, I have a question. Why does everyone else in the world call it football, besides in the U.S.? Well, we we created all languages. Like even the English stole our language, which I thought was crazy. <laughs> the English stole English. Yeah, the English stole English from us, and I think that's really messed up. <laughs> it would be crazy if we can actually oh wait well, you can make a goal out of chisel oh yeah we could actually make like a netted goal potentially yeah i was just gonna half-ass a goal real quick but that definitely would work are you good at chiseling i've I never think tried it. the person to do that i think she's good chiseler yeah maybe i can oh, yeah, commission yeah. a soccer ball goal goal from her it might she's canadian though so it might have uh, canadian soccer dimensions but we'll see Canada did have the greatest I'm... goalkeeper of all time, Tim Hortons. So, I mean. <laughs> the U.S. had Tim Howard, but Canada had Tim Hortons, and I think that's pretty cool. Nothing was getting by Tim Hortons or Tim Howard. <laughs> yeah, my, my favorite soccer player is Warren Buffett. Oh, nice, dude. Did you know he was a billionaire before he got Bitcoin? Now he's a millionaire. <laughs> that's... Why does that sound so sad? <laughs> why, why does that sound so sad? I don't know, Side said it one night and it was the funniest thing I ever fucking heard. <laughs> Every fucking currency went to shit, that's fine. <laughs> the only coin I ever got actually lucky with, with was, was, which was hilarious, I bought it as a meme. Oh, and no. I ended up selling it really fast. What was it? Was Doge. Oh, really? You had Dude, doggy it, coins? Man, I had doggy coins a, wh a while ago, and and this is when they first kind of launched, and I bought a shit ton just for fun. I shit you not, I, 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 I spent like $1,200, $1,500. I cashed out at nearly over nearly 100k plus. That's pretty goddamn good. So you got the doggies before everyone else had the doggies. Yeah, and then, the, then Elon Musk did that whole thing, and then I just sold it instantly when he announced it. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. 
Yeah, like, yeah, that, that's not gonna end well. <laughs> and it didn't. <laughs> it crashed instantly. Oh, no. One time we were playing uh, Call of Duty and we were making fun of NFTs and someone on the other team heard us and I think they were drunk and they thought we were talking about how great NFTs are and then he's like, hey, how about you guys shove your NFTs up your pussy? And uh, it was the funniest thing we've ever heard. It was so out of pocket. <laughs> we were just like, what? It's like, I don't even have a pussy. Where, where am I supposed to put my NFTs? It doesn't make yeah, any pussy. sense. You excited to play soccer? Look you at this, need... my dude. We have actual soccer balls. No way. Wait, what? Dude, you put oh, the no. soccer in the hole, bro. That's not how soccer works. Oh, we're gonna break another I... soccer ball. I shouldn't have given you the soccer before the pitch was done. Yeah, the problem is now. If, I mean, you can we, can, I can. we can actually hit that out if you think about it. Hold on. I'm gonna try to mine it again. Oh, okay, I got it. I did that same yeah, thing earlier, like... and the soccer just broke. You get any help? Oh, now that I'm almost done, probably not. I mean, just toss me someone, just do the other side. All right. There you go, King. I'll meet you in the middle, like we're eating spaghetti together. Yeah. Was, was that an asshole answer, chat? Now that I'm almost done, I'm probably not going to need any help. <laughs> now that you've watched me fill in the entire thing, why, yes, I would. That's like... No, that's way too sexual of an example. I don't know if that's a good one for today. We did it, team! We did Yay. it! If these dimensions were correct, the goal would only be like this wide? That seems pretty small to me. So, I don't... Yeah, yeah, what's up? Hit F5. It helps you when you want to see overview. What do you mean? You hit F5, you go into you go into third person, and it actually kind of helps. Oh, dude, I didn't know F5 existed. Thanks, Wonton. So, first off, these don't affect people. Do they affect soccer ball? It does not. Okay, so this dude's got a fucking mind of its own, dude. Can I make a soccer goal? Then maybe we can have some pressure plates or something that if the ball hits it, then it uh, sh it sends up like fireworks into the sky. I think that'd be easy. Looks like the ball never stops. Like, are you guys noticing that? It's like a constant game of Pong, essentially. Um, Does it ever run out of speed or does it just perpetually move at that? That's interesting. No friction having ass, yeah. Can we just like stop it? No. Okay. I just wanted my soccer back. Dude, I just want my fucking soccer, bro. I don't care about the achievements. Okay, I think our soccer ball's just gonna keep soccer. Ah, shut up. I think I think our soccer is just gonna keep soccering. My soccer ball gained sentience, chat, and I'm not too happy about it. Sports ball. Sports ball. How many ants do you think are there in the world? Slack attack. Hey, my stock. My soccer is oh. still moving. Yeah, what's up? How many ants? Uh, probably another. It's probably an unfathomable number, you know. Like, Probably in the trillions. Like dodecatrillions? Like, you know when you, you think type... think dodecatrillion? You know that copy pasta where you type seven, like, 30 times, and it, it just keeps hey, going... Hey, the most compatible... Oh, uh, the, oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know oh, that one, not that one? But yeah, if you, like, oh, okay. TTS the number seven, like, 300 times, it's, like, 700 quadrillion, 700 dodecacillion, do... Like, is that how many ants there is? I'm going to look this up. Can I look this up? I'm going to look this up. I'm going to be placing leaves. Come let me know once you uh, Google how many ants there are in the world. It's saying about 20 quadrillion ants. Dude, that's a fuck ton. Now, do they actually know that or do they just take some stupid guess? Because, like, I feel like that's Biologi impossible to count them all. Biologists the uh, specializing in the study of ants have calculated the that there are around 20 quadrillion ants worldwide. 
Imagine a million, billion, or the number one followed by 15 zeros. Um, and then over 14,000 distinct species and subspecies within that. So why aren't so, they trying to outnumber us? Is it because they're not smart enough or too small? Or I think uh, they can't settle their differences. I mean, yeah, if, oh. if all those ants got into one place at one time, I think uh, I think we're fucking through. I think uh, it's over. Because have you ever watched Rick and Morty? There's like a, a character on Rick and Morty called 10 million ants or 10,000 ants, right? And he's just, oh, like, yeah, 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 he's fucking awesome. He, he's from that, uh, the Vindicators episode, if I'm correct. And he's just, he's great. I feel like if more of the ants did that and worked together to make like large transformers, it would be fantastic. Well, ants can carry a lot of their body weight, but like how much is too much? You know, you got 10 million ants. It's like they can only carry about like, you know, a certain amount. Do you know those seeds that weight. fall from the oak trees that kind of turn into helicopters? Have you ever seen those? Oh, yeah. I've seen ants by themselves carrying one of those before. And it's really what impressive it, what happens? to see. I bet it is. But what about that ant that's at the bottom on with every single other ant on top of it? Do you think he's going to get smushed? That's a good point. I guess not if they're working together like that. And then also, like, let's say in Rick and Morty, all the ants come together to make one person. Is there like a hierarchy there of who gets to be like hand ants and who gets to be asshole ants when they form a person? Who gets to be the dick ants? Yeah. Um, probably like natural selection, you know? It's this guy like, was built to be a testicle ant. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe there's like a sign up list or something like that. I guess we're arguing about some or like discussing something that's theoretical and would never exist. Do you so. think that Ant Man could be like a sentient being and actually like do what humans do? What if Ant Man climbed up into Thanos' asshole and then expanded? I can't believe he explained that on a yacht trip. <laughs> 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 it just you seems see like the clip? perfect way to get rid of Thanos. But yeah, no, I Thanus. didn't see that. Clip. <laughs> and then put those rumors to rest, baby. <laughs> yeah, I could have done it, but you know, it would have been physically impossible. It just seems like such an easy himself. solution, but whatever. He was what he was constipated at the time. He couldn't get anywhere. Oh jeez. Um Man, that, that anal cavity was filled, brother. Oh god. Hey, do you think you can put together a soccer team of like three to four soccer stars to go against the crew soccer boys? Maybe. That was a long pause. Do you not have any friends? Oh, I was looking at the people who were on. Oh, no, this would be like another uh, another night, you know? Yeah, I, I mean, I could probably do it. Okay. I would just have to see who kind of like wants to actually get on and be a part of this you know, wonderful server we have here. Yeah, um, I'm sure we can figure it out. Maybe I'll have some of my people reach out to some of your people on the Discord and we can discuss a fun soccer game. It would probably suck anyway, because oh. I doubt that soccer ball is too much fun, but I just wanted to make a soccer today, I think. I think you are validated, you are heard, um, and this is this is beautiful. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. I'll kick it. I'm gonna kick, kick the it. soccer. Why is it white? It's white now. It's white. What? You can ride the soccer? Oh, wait. Oh, it's like... <laughs> See, that's like a whole new level of taunting. Like, I can kick the soccer. Wait, can I kick it and do you stay with it? Whoa. I'm like the DVD logo. <laughs> Boing. But he never hits the corners. Boing. Yeah, I'm like that logo, but yeah, I'd never do the cool thing. <laughs> Pretty fucking lame. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Okay, cool. Um, Sweet, we just need players now, and then maybe a few more on aesthetics, but I think we got a jolly soccer pitch here. I'm pretty happy. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I was maybe going to add some bleachers and stuff, but I don't know if I feel like making I'm bleachers I'm getting too today. far away, King. Oh, what do we do about that? Go! Golasso! See? You did it, bro. I did it. Thanks. Also, man. I was going to put some this. pressure plates over there, and then whenever the soccer goes on top of them, it hits them, and like fireworks go shooting off in the corners or whatever. Oh, we can definitely do that. Yeah. And then I might make like 
one team the red team and the blue team and then like one one side's a little themed in their colors and stuff like that i think it will look cool i, I just gotta get maybe get some more you land grab i already moved someone's entire business over here um to, to make some space but I i'm sure it's fine <laughs> You monster. <laughs> I, this, I feel this like this has it. been here forever and Puffy hasn't done much with it. So I was like, I'm just going to push up against it. See how much uh, backlash that gives me. Maybe I can go to court again. And I don't I don't it. know who that is. Who is that? Uh, That's Captain Puffy. You've maybe played Among Us with them once or twice. Maybe. Hmm. Maybe. Yeah. Um, They're very cool, though. So I doubt they would be too mad at me for doing this. So we'll see. And I'm trying to think of something you could do to like keep score. But uh, I, I'm thinking create things and wouldn't want to mesh too much create. In so here. Um, I was thinking we play regular soccer ball. And then if we want to play soccer ball again, we could get some crazy gadgets and gizmos in here. We could, <gasps> we could see if the soccer ball interacts with like uh, I can... spinners and shit like that. Oh! Like, you know, that thing that harvests your trees, it spins we can around pinball. Oh, my fucking God. We could just have two people sitting here pressing buttons and then the things will paddle out. It so, could be done. Could you theoretically have, um, like, let's say we had teams of four, right? Where three people play soccer and then each team has, like, um, someone who's on, like, a crow's nest that has buttons that, like, pull a spinner out of the ground and start spinning it and stop it so that when it helps their team, they can hit the spinner so the ball goes flying forward if it interacts with it. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, because you know, uh, I guess problem, the thing I'm thinking it, of is the lawnmower machine, like the thing that you had a, uh, like spin that like cut the trees down. Would that be able to interact yeah. and hit the soccer ball and send it flying, or would it break the soccer ball? I guess. I don't. Yeah, that's a good question. I don't know if it will do anything with that'd it. That'd be sweet if we had like flippers in the corners that like the ball went to the corner. Whoever's like the the crow's nest person on the team hits the right button for the like right flipper and sends the ball towards the other side. And I think that'd be pretty fun. But yeah, if the balls interact with create stuff, I mean, that would slap, but I don't know if they do. Yeah, I'll have to test that. Yeah, because even the cars made them lag a little bit, so I'm not sure. Soccer ball. I'm going to test it. Ooh, we got a little test right now. Dude, do you think it'll work? Maybe. <laughs> Please hit it. Right, soccer's right coming. Here. Soccer's coming. Send I it. Yeah, dude, no oh. way. Oh, it stops it though. All right, I, I, I think I can fix that. Hold on, hold on. Get it ready again. Yeah, yeah. Let me bring the soccer back this way. Okay, I changed the setting so it will never place. Soccer. Oh, I might have soccered it wrong. Hold on, I'm trying soccer. Yeah. Yeah. It does seem to just stop it, unfortunately. Okay, I will. I don't know if I can make it go any slower. Push it a little forward, just a teensy bit. Oh, oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let me go grab Kinda? the soccer. Hold I on. feel like I, I just feel like I'm send moving it, it, it too fast. And with the hand crank, I can't really. That didn't kill slow it. it. That down. hit it, and it's not but dead right now. If I wired it up correctly, I can make it move pretty slow. Um. Okay, but it's, it it's kind of movement now. It's working. It's so, fucky, yeah, but it's yeah, working. It's, it's just, I, yeah, it needs to be slower. That that could work. It could work. Holy shit. Okay, yeah, we can look into potentially trying some stuff like that. Um, also, like, does the soccer ball interact with, like, slime blocks or anything? Like that Like that it would bounce? Hmm. Looks like that just oh. stops it. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, it would work if he yeah, had yeah, some trap zone. Yeah. Potential. We could just make giant foosball. <laughs> Dude, that would actually be sick. We, we're just gonna have like a whole area of like fields that the ball works with. <laughs> this one's foosball. This one's uh, soccer. This one's f American football. Goal! <laughs> yeah! I like our soccer. Um, Sweet. I'll see you tomorrow and uh, have a lovely night, Mr. Slack. Hey, you too. Yeah. Wait, I got stuff in Big my man. See, my dude. Do you want your ball? Oh, I was just... I don't know how to pick it up without it maybe breaking, so I was just going to let it ball all night long. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if that's Sounds a problem, good. but yeah, I don't know how to pick it up, so I was just going to let it ball the fuck out. <laughs> okay. I'm sure it's fine. All right, does the soccer look cool from up here? Like, if you're chilling in the second floor? I think that looks pretty neat. It just kind of looks like D20's so rich he has a fucking soccer. 
which is probably fine, you know? Yeah. I think that fills that area out pretty well, though, because that was, like, just, like, a weird spot before, so should be good. Oh, she got rid of the item frames. That looks amazing. Oh, that's sick. So are they just, like, not there anymore? I love that. Okay, that's amazing. So, yeah, there was, like, uh, item frames there before. That looks way better, though. Oh, hell yeah, bruv. 